Yeah, I think some, some valid questions were, were being asked uh, about uh, Blackwatch Pass. As we know, it's been going on for a little while now to get it completed. Uh, towards the end of the questioning period, it, it became a bit speculative, I believe, uh, in some of the questions. But I want to go back to what I think uh, originally they were looking for, questions uh, um, uh, and answers that they were looking for. Um, the question was really asked, uh, what was the budget for this particular project? Uh, when governments, whether it was our, it's our government or former governments, when we budget for things, roadworks fits under a particular category, and uh, that is uh, roadworks throughout the island on the capital projects. It was budgeted for 2015-16, uh, five million dollars to that uh, allocation, so that any roadworks, capital roadworks in Bermuda would come out of that fund. That is the budget set for it. Asking the question, is there a budget set for Blackwatch Pass, is a bit misleading because it falls under a broader category. Other cost estimates, however, which probably should have been the question, in place. Obviously, there are cost estimates that are in place, but that's not what they were asking. So I can see how people were beginning to get confused. Uh, certainly we are watching our, our, our dollars as we uh, continue to do the work on uh, Black Watch Pass. It will be finished uh, in two weeks' time. And as I stated, uh, we have spent $700 or thousand dollars thus far on Black Watch Pass. Uh, that's where we are. We believe it will probably come in just under a million dollars once it is completed, uh, but I don't have those final figures right now. The original plan took place in 2010, the plans that were drawn up. So when those plans were drawn up at that particular time, obviously there were some thoughts as to cost estimates and what it would cost to do. As you go along with these projects, um, many things can happen as you go along with a, a project like this. Uh, it was not known all of the wires and cables potentially that were under the ground. Um, we know that we ran into difficulties with Belco, uh, them wanting to do some repair works as well. So all of these things added to some of the costs that are involved. Um, but I am happy to say that our team is really working well uh, on Blackwatch Pass, and I'm happy to say that we'll be finished this project uh, as I've taken it on throughout this last 10 months, um, that it will come to completion. No, not at all. I mean, certainly uh, we would cost out, for instance, you know, what the wall would take for us to get down. We can give those numbers, but that's not what was asked. Some concerns raised by the allocation of land. Yes. And yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in the 2010-11 uh, uh, plans that were laid out, there was uh, uh, plans to take government land, sorry, uh, public land from the park, as well as land from the governor uh, that had already been outlaid. Uh, both were a part of the original plan. They mentioned that there was an original plan that only took from the governor's property. Uh, and I have not seen those plans. They are nowhere to be found. So I'm not sure where they're getting that from. The plans that are in place that we have, uh, that have gone through planning department and the likes from 2010, show that not only were parks land going to be used, but also government uh, the governor's land was going to be used as well. So both were going to be used uh, to accommodate the roundabout. Uh, I think there was some question as to the uh, the, the, the well there, um, the Blackwatch Pass well. Uh, there was an opportunity to increase uh, the land mass for parklands there. It was done, very minimal uh, uh, increase of that area, uh, but there was felt that there was no hindrance to traffic in creating the roundabout by doing that. So the original plans show um, what were there all along and what is there now. Uh, slight adjustments, very, very, very small adjustments, but parkland at the end of the day was always going to be used and the governor's property was always going to be impeded on as well.